this dress is a little spicy for Target. And I want my little extra situation right here too. Cause when I tell y'all it is right at the tip of my nips. Is this a Camaro? A Camaro? Let me find out. They got a little spicy granny piece. A little Katsy. Katsy. If you wanna have my back rolls out, then have the back rolls out. Don't do like a little peekaboo. Show them all. Hey gems, it's your girl Miss Chamima and we are back at it again with another video. So today we are going to be doing a Target haul and baby lately Target has been coming out with a gem so I cannot wait to dive into these pieces. But before we do that, make sure that you are subscribed, make sure you send this video to your friends, your cousins, your auntie, your daddy, all the above, make sure that they're subscribed so that we can get into the content. Cause like, what are you waiting for? Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Go ahead and subscribe, sis. Now let's get to the video. <laughs> so first we have this super cute lace set. And I don't know, I thought this was perfect for spring. This would be a cute little post on the gram. Um, I wanted to see it in person first because I was like, it could, it could veer off towards like granny land. But I feel like with the way you, you know, accessorize it, the details that you add to it, It'll be a vibe. So let's try it on. Chap. I got both top and bottom in a 3X. Did I just lie about that or is that the truth? No, that's the truth. <laughs> okay, barely. Uh, these are some short shorts. <laughs> wow. Yeah, these are some short shorts and if I bend over, this is where the, the line of demarcation is for my cheek. <laughs> this is for my short girls, perhaps. Um, Cause I could not get away with any shorts. Not if I actually plan on moving around that day. Yo, I just threw this top on here forgetting that it was lace. Getting caught on everything. Ooh. Now. <laughs> This might still be a cute Instagram post though. <laughs> so we are going to see how the top fits. Hold on, let me move my mirror. I'm trying to see, honey. Let me take a look at these beats. Okay, so like I said, I think that the accessories and the way that you style this is definitely what's going to make the difference. <gasps> oh. Yeah, while I feel like I can make this into a cute Instagram post, I personally would not wear this in real life outside for me personally. Um, the shorts are just too short for me. And the fact that they're short and loose is very scary. But for my shorter girls or my flatter girls, this is your time to shine, honey. This is your time to shine. Now the top is pretty see-through, so make sure that whatever you wear underneath is okay with being shown. I'd probably opt for a nude undergarment so that you can't tell there's anything underneath. Or if I had a pop of color underneath, I'd probably make it match with like the bag or something. Like if I did white, i will make it like a green and white look or something like that, but yeah. Also, this would be really cute as separate. So this is some jeans. This is a cute like white bodysuit would be a vibe as well. Yeah, but who baby, these things are short for me. These are some, some short shorts. Short shorts. <laughs> Ooh, all right, y'all. Let's, let's, let's try something else. Let me find out. They got a little spicy granny piece. Mm. <laughs> next. <laughs> okay, so next I got this dress here, which is, very outside of my norm. <laughs> but I wanted to try something different, see, see what I could do with it. And um, I don't know, I don't know. Um, so first of all, they, this, this dress has cutouts on the sides. Now I typically don't gravitate towards pieces like that because as you can see on my body, you don't see the effect of the cutout. Um, 
I believe it's meant to be worn on the shoulder. But y'all know me, I like to wear everything off the shoulder if possible. So yeah, it's... Is it giving princess? Princess vibes? Surprisingly, it's not too short. It's longer on me than I thought it was gonna be. But if I did wear it, I would wear it off the shoulder. I, I don't know. I mean, I'm just, mm, I'm just not feeling the vibes, honestly. I'm just not feeling the vibes. A little curtsy, curtsy. Um, yeah, this dress is not for me. Yeah, let's move on. The back is stretchy though. So if you know the dress stuff isn't stretchy, you can get away with having a little extra room to breathe because of this. So next I got this really cute top. I got it in a size 2X and I do have the straps extended as far as possible. But I do think that would have been a little bit more comfortable in a three just so I could have more length here. And I wouldn't mind a little extra situation right here too. Because when I tell y'all it is right at the tip of my nips, I am not lying. But it is a really cute top. And the more I look at it, the more I'm like in love. So I did tuck my bra in underneath the girls. So this is pretty much what it looks like with no coverage. Now if you would like to enhance this look with this uh, strapless bra, by all means, do as you please. But um, <laughs> this is cute. I got this in a black, I got this in white, I got this in a blue and white color. <laughs> I, I just knew I was gonna love this, honey. This is up my alley. And I think I got them all in a 2X. Ooh, cha. yeah, I did. So this is from the brand Wild Fable. And I feel like these are super cute tops that you can just kind of throw on with some jeans, throw on with some leggings whatever skirt and it automatically adds a little something because of the way that it's shaped it's giving like bubble but not like bubbly but like bubble <laughs> but yeah child I, mean, I won't be jumping and then and, and going to no soca fets in this but she's a vibe for sure a vibe for sure and the whole straight neckline you guys know <laughs> I live for a square neckline. I just find it so attractive on myself personally. I just love how it looks, honey. I love everything about this. The 3X might be a little bit more comfortable, but overall, this is a vibe. This is a yes for me. Now, I have some bottoms to try on and I have no idea how they're going to fit. This is a Future Collective collab with Gabriella Karifa Johnson. I saw this one in store actually, not online. And I picked this up in a size 24. It does have stretch. And it is giving... What does this give? <sighs> Honestly, I'm very scared to see the results. I'm very scared. Because like, oh. Mm. Come on. <laughs> oh. Now I'm thinking I, I might have to get the waist tailored and don't. <laughs> Ha, 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 and don't. Um, I just, I wasn't sure what direction I would go in with these. And now that I'm looking at them on the body, oh, I would still have to get it tailored if I didn't want to keep them. Yeah. Uh, I figured it was giving like a culotte vibe, you know, dress it up with some like heels or something. Mm. But honestly, I'm just not a fan of this in my body. I'm really just not. First of all, I can't breathe. <laughs> it is a bit of stretch, but it's just, it's a stretchy day, so I'm not tripping. Girl might be tripping. I'm tripping. Um, yeah, me and Target jeans don't always vibe, but that's because I love a heap load of stretch. I know some girls don't, so if you don't and you're into the style, Target might be the way for you, but this personally is going to be a no for me. Um, maybe if it was just a little shorter, like it was giving more like Bermuda, but still oversized, I think I would 
I would like that more. I don't know. I don't know. I just know I don't love it. Yeah. All right. Next. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh. These are very cute. These are wide-legged pants. They do have stretch to them. I got these, I wanna say 20, oh, I got these in a 22. I should've got them in a 24. It's a little bit tight. It's a little bit tight. I did pick these up in store. A win for me. So I'm trying to remember, did I pick the 22 on purpose or did they not have 24? I'm gonna have to figure that out, but these are actually really cute. And yeah, I'm gonna exchange these for a bigger size. Even though I can't really wear these with heels, if we're being honest, how often am I wearing heels anyways? <laughs> a cute sandal will do. But these are so cute. Oh, if you can see the vision without the tightness of the pants on my stomach. Oh, I wish they were just a little longer. I would love to wear these with heels. I feel like that would be so stinking cute. Even with like a top like this or the black version, do a black on black on black. <sighs> a vibe, darling. It's a vibe for sure. Absolutely. Absolutely. I like these. And it's real pockets, y'all. Real pockets. <laughs> Love that. But yeah, if it just went down a tad bit more, can you see? It's like... Mm, right before it hits my heel, slightly grazing the top of my foot. Hmm. Next. <laughs> you know what? If I'm being honest, <laughs> this wasn't a realistic buy for me. This was kind of just like, all right, let's just... Let's just buy it and see. And you know what? It's one of those pieces where once again, I can't wear it in public because if I bend over. <laughs> but this reminds me of like old school style denim skirts. Y'all. <sighs> this is so cute. The little pleats in the front. <laughs> this is so cute. I like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. The waist could use some hemming, but not hemming, tailoring, but it's actually not that big of a deal. This is actually really freaking cute. Oh, I feel like this, the black version of this with some chunky, like really thick sole chunky boots, it's giving. Paramore, okay, period. This is actually really freaking cute. <laughs> I like it. I like it, I like it a lot. I'm just have to wear shorts underneath it cause like, if you see shorts, you see shorts. Why you open my skirt? That's the real question. Why you open my skirt? Hmm. So, this doesn't look terrible from the front and clearly i'm going through something with all these tiny skirts this is actually a skirt by the way not not that you can see girl where's the there it is <laughs> the cooter part this is a skirt, and the front don't look crazy but i don't like these little crop tops that has a high back because i got a big back don't mind the bra. I told y'all I done tucked it underneath the 80s and I tucked it between some rolls so you're gonna see it. Mind your business. You wanna see the top or not? <sighs> so, like I said, I don't like tops with the high back because it just, I feel like it just puts my rolls on display. And if my rolls are gonna be on display, they should all be on display. Not like a peekaboo situation. Cause then it looks like it's just like being squeezed out between the clothes. <laughs> 
you know when you open a Pillsbury, a Pillsbury um, like biscuit or something and that first little pop and it starts to come out the side of that slit? That's what it looked like. So for me personally, I'm not a fan of high back situations. And you don't see nothing right here, mind your business. You don't see nothing, okay? But yeah, so while I do see the potential, this is not for me. This is not for me. Um, the waistline on this is a little too big. I got this in a three. The top is in a three, two. I had a nerve to get it in a three and a two. The two would have, <sighs> please. The three is barely making it. A two, <laughs> let me get this in a six. Thank you so much. Um, but yeah, <sighs> next. <laughs> okay, so I size down to 2X on both the top and the bottom, just because sometimes knit pieces like this can be real stretchy and I like for them to be real tight on the body, yaddy, yaddy. Now I'm not mad per se at the 2X, but I do find that I do have a bit of a shelf situation with this pair. It's not the biggest deal. I still think that 2X was the way to go. As you guys can see, like there's a little bit of a crotch situation here. So I feel like going up in a size definitely would have enhanced that. Um, and because this has a wider sleeve, you can wear a supportive garment underneath it without having the straps to show, which, you know, I prefer not to happen. Um, but overall, she's cute. I like the darker hemline. I feel like it adds a little something something. I wish it was darker on the edges over here too and not just the center. Cause that would be super cute, I think. But it's not my design, darling. But it is cute. It is cute. If I do say so myself. It's on a thicker end though. So if you want this piece, go ahead and cop it now, honey. <laughs> Get it now and wear it now. If it's a little chilly, put it on a cardi. If it's hot, put on the sandal. We'll wear it now. It's that time. Now, I also picked up this super cute crop top, which I love. I think it's so cute. I absolutely need a yellow purse to go with this because it's really the only color that will ever go. I mean, not that will ever go, but I just feel like wearing a yellow purse with this would make it pop. <gasps> I will still wear this even with this shirt. Oh my God. Okay. Probably not these shorts, but. Actually, yes, I would. With a yellow bag, oh my gosh. I love this, this is really cute. <laughs> I love this shirt. It's longer in the front, shorter in the back. As you can see, darling. Hmm. Is this a Camaro? A Camaro? I really like this. This is a vibe for sure. <laughs> All right, y'all, I also got a kimono. Let me show you. <laughs> Child, it's a layers for me. It's given there's no space in my suitcase at the airport. <laughs> but I thought this was really cute. I like pieces like this because you can wear them as a beach cover up. You can wear them over dresses. You can wear these over like jeans and a top. And the print is really what gives it life. And I figure these different tones of like Pink and magenta would be a vibe for the spring. Girl, this tag could stop stab me. That would be nice. <laughs> That'd be nice. Now this baby don't have no stretch. I'm seeing a pattern here. <laughs> seeing a pattern. But she still fits nicely. The arms still fit. Love that. Hold on. Let's see if I can get this to tie to see how it looks. Yeah, it'd be nice if she could close a little more, but. That's all right. It's all right, Monica, it's all right. She's still really cute. A vibe for sure. Now, it's the color that makes this for me because the print itself could go left real quick. So once again, how you style it is going to make the biggest difference, okay? Keep it cute. Keep it simple, it's already a lot going on. <laughs> And you should be good. I think she's cute. I like it. So next we have this really cute dress. And I'm going to need your guys' help with this one. So 
I typically go for dresses like this, I'm not gonna hold you, but because of the material, it's like a chiffon -y type thingy. It does have a, a lining to it, but it's not enough to like, really like hoist the girls up. Um, and the girls are looking longer in this one, even for me. So I'm not sure how I feel about this. And clearly with a top like this, you would have to do a tape kind of bra. You can't go with a strapless bra or anything because it'll show. Am I tripping or does this not look good the way I feel like it does it? Like, I just feel like it don't look good. But the dress itself is super cute. If you're perkier on top or if you're smaller, whatever the case may be, or you are okay with wearing tape, this is really cute. It's high-low, very flowy, lightweight, perfect for the upcoming warmer seasons. And um, she's actually really freaking cute. I like that it's like muted-ish neutrals. Like usually with, with patterns like this, it'll be like neutral in black, but it's neutral in brown and it looks really like fuzzy in person. Um, so it's not like super distinct prints on it. And I love that. It's like calm and collected, even though it's like technically rare, you know? But it's like subtle, like a rare, rare. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is actually a really nice dress. This is so cute. Like, would I take the girls up for this? I personally am not a fan of tape, even though I found tape that works. I've tried Brassy Bra and that definitely works, but I'm just not a tape girl. I'm not, but man, man oh man, it's just a beautiful dress. And I believe they have like three other colors and prints situation for you to pick from. So if this is not your vibe, I think they had black, like a green and white or something. They just, they had, look into it, okay? It's so cute. Uh, it's so cute. No, I'm so sad about this. Child, I just knew I was going to be in somebody's country in this dress. <laughs> it's giving that. <laughs> nah but it's so cute mm. i wish the back was a little longer but it's a pretty decent average height for all the girls you know yeah i'm not mad at all super cute dress ah <sighs> tear oh okay wait hold on hold on target this you Wait a minute. Oh my God. Wait. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Okay. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Yes. Now this is me. Hold on. This dress is perfect <laughs> see now this is how i like to do it if you gonna have my back rolls out then have the back rolls out don't do like a little peekaboo show them all okay now i'm not gonna lie i was a little surprised when i saw this because they have the back out like this i feel like this dress is a little raunchy for target <laughs> this dress is a little spicy for target and that's how he knows right on my alley. It has a split here, slinky-ish material, but it does have lining underneath and together it does have really good weight on it. Square-ish neckline, my fave. Uh, no, this is, this is the one, darling. <laughs> darling, this is the one. This is the one. Oh, I'm so glad I also got this in black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is stunning. I love this. Ah! Mm -mm. This is the one vibes. This is the star of the show. For me personally, I don't know about you, but for me, this is the star of the show. I'm so glad I purchased her. Goes down to the ankle. <sighs> She's stunning. She is absolutely stunning. What do you guys think of the pieces from the haul? I think that there were some hits and misses for me personally, but all in all, I found most of the styles to be really cute. The quality to be fairly decent. There are some pieces that I need to exchange for a better size, but overall, I'm quite happy with the pieces that I picked. 
Let me know what you guys think down below, which piece is your favorite, if you're planning on copying any of these. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Toodles.